Okay, guys, I'm back. Uh, it's been a while, but um, just want to get your thoughts on a few things, and let's let's just start real quick with UFC. Chris Weidman takes care of Anderson Silva. Anderson Silva had no hands, but December 28th is Weidman and Silva two. So what do you guys think? Was it fixed? Was it not? And like, if it was fixed, and I, like I'm saying, a bit of both. I'm, I'm, yes. I mean, Silva, he's, 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 he's known for that kind of stuff. But thing is, there was a apparently, and this is what I've read. There was a million dollar bet going on, and that kind of says to me something's up. So that's being investigated. But was it was it fixed? Was it not? What'd you think of the other fights? What'd you think of Frankie Edgar? And obviously he's back and like he never left. And so that's it for UFC. And uh, hopefully I will have more from a uh, UFC 165. Will I will be at? I'm finally going to a UFC that's in Toronto. I've missed out on the other three. So uh, there you go. Look for that soon. Tonight's Raw, Maddox as the GM. Kind of like it. I mean, Maddox as, as a character, perfect. He's the guy that everyone wants to hate, makes a little mistake here and there, which gets him more hated. But thing is, the thing is, man, this, oh, this McMahon power struggle storyline is going to be lasting a long time. It's going to be lasting pretty much until WrestleMania 30. And I really, really hate USA Network for wanting more McMahons. They, they, they wanted more McMahons on TV, and they got it. I mean, we're, and now we're, now we're stuck with the three of them. I say three of them, almost four, because... Shane McMahon has uh, apparently been asked to uh, appear later on, and so hopefully he comes back. I kind of miss Shane, the old Shane. And ev everyone's seen the, the most recent picture of Shane with the gray hair. What the hell? But personally, Shane back will add to that storyline and make it a little more tolerable than the three of them. And uh, Cena made his choice for SummerSlam main event. Yes. 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 I really, really wanted this to happen. Because I think this is pretty much kind of a, we're sorry we didn't put you over at Money in the Bank Sunday night. And they wanted to put over Mr. Divorce Orton. I really hated that, and I I was just I didn't I never even saw the show, so I didn't see RVD till tonight. Great match, RVD and Jericho, by the way. Bottom line, with the whole um, uh, Orton thing, and I didn't really want, he doesn't deserve me. Not saying he doesn't deserve it because he is a main eventer guy, but the guy is having so many problems. Why put on the extra stress of title defenses and all that on him. So, giving it to Brian and having those two fight at, at a SummerSlam in LA, oh, can't, can't ask for anything more. So, with that being said, I need comments, I need likes, I need anything you guys can talk about. See it, the silver fix or not. Talk about that. Anything you want to put on comment board, you know the deal. Adios, my friends.